Here's the reason why the narcissist gets mad over the smallest, most petty things ever. And they get so angry and so mad to the point where it's almost like they're about to set the whole town on fire. They get so upset and you just can't understand why they're so mad about this tiny little thing and it could be something as little as you didn't shut the door maybe you left the light on in the bathroom something like you didn't you, you slammed the door the car door they will be so mad so mad and you think the whole world is about to end i'll tell you why they do that the reason the, the narcissist gets so upset and you can see the demon come out of their eyes their whole eyes turn black over the smallest things is because of control. See, the narcissist function better when they know that they can control you. Everything about the narcissist is about control. And one of the biggest thing they must have control over is your emotions. So this is a tactic for them. And here's a big kicker. They're not really mad. What they're trying to do is to trigger your emotions. What they're trying to do is for you to reassure them that they have full control of your emotions. So they act like they're so mad. They're so mad. And then you break down. You start crying. You start apologizing. You start, you know, you just, they got you exactly where they want you. They have control. Control is everything to the narcissist they're not really mad they're not mad at all and this is why it's so, it's so confusing when you bring actual concerns to the narcissist about things that they've done to you about ways that they've disrespected you about something they did to hurt you they tell you it's not a big deal they'll laugh and say oh my god you take everything so serious Oh my God, it, it really wasn't that serious. Oh my God, it was just a joke. Oh my goodness, are you seriously mad? Are you really upset? And they could do the worst thing to you. They could disrespect you. They could violate you in the worst way. And you bring it up to them and they just laugh about it. Why? Because they don't want you to have control of their emotions. But they will do the same thing over something so petty just so they can know that they have control over your emotions. So the next time the narcissist, this is for people who are still involved with the narcissist, maybe still living with the narcissist. The next time they start to fly off the, the I don't know, ledge about something you apparently did, just stay calm, stay cool, and stay collected. If you have to apologize, just say, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize I left the door open. I'll do better next time. When you do that, it completely disarms, uh, disarms them. They don't know what just hit them. They don't know what happened. They will completely be confused and lost. Because guess what? They do that to you. So the best way to disarm them when they get fake mad, when they're so angry, is for you to stay calm. Don't engage. Even if they're calling you the worst name, even if they're punching the walls, even if they're acting like the whole world is about to end, just say, mm, I'm sorry. I didn't realize I did that. I'm sorry. I didn't realize that happened. And see how they react. This completely disarms the narcissist and they will never be able to figure you out. And if they, they were doing that to use it as reactive abuse, they just lost because you didn't react. So if they had that secret camera somewhere to record your reaction, it didn't work. If they had that secret phone in their pocket to record your response, it didn't work. You disarmed them. This is when you become very powerful with the narcissist. Remember the narcissist uses silence to punish you. 
They gray rock you. They stonewall you. They use these tactics as further ways to control you. And I'm not saying play games with the narcissist. I'm not saying do what they do. I'm just saying take control back. Take your control back of your emotions. And this is also for someone who has left the narcissist. When you see that they're mad and they're throwing temper tantrums and spreading rumors and smearing your name and, and defaming your character, stay calm, stay cool, stay collected. It's going to disarm them. That is the best tool you can use against the narcissist. This is the best way to disarm the narcissist. Follow for more.